All right, let's see what we got. Okay, what do we have? Assured victory, I'm sure. Sure, 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 sure. Oh, she's got like... Frick, man. Okay, who wants a free level? I'm gonna drop it to Aisha. She has nothing left, so this is basically a guaranteed kill. So I'm gonna run her forward. I'm gonna surround her. I'm gonna shoot her in the face with fireballs until she falls over and that cries uncle. Sounds like a hopping all the time. Though I think her spells are pretty much entirely defensive. If I'm to remember properly. Yeah, resurrect and holy shield. I can use holy shield to waste some time to get like an extra free hits and whatnot. Well, that's not nice. I'm not pleased by that at all. There we go. Well, what I can do in that case, I'll just go ahead and resurrect, stop the clock. They'll get some extra attacks going in, assuming they can hit. There we go. And so far as I understand, so long as I actually end with these amount of troops at the end, uh, I'll actually keep them. You know, it doesn't say, okay, you, you were down to 20, so after the resurrection you only keep 20. No, you, you ended at 39 troops, so you keep 39 troops. Damn, I was too busy talking, I kind of forgot to hit Holy Shield to, you know, force the ending. But she got captured anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter in the long, shorter things. The long, shorter things? You know what I mean. I don't want to examine anything, thank you. So just to make sure I'm not full of shit. That is what happened, right? Yes. I lost one troop out of that, I feel baller. Suitably baller at that. I have no need for you. I have no need for any of you for that matter. Sylvia, Malene. Why is Sylvia over what's her face? I don't know, because I can, I guess. Let's roll you down here. Okay, what do we got? Oh, how adorable. Soldier, soldier, samurai, soldier. Okay. Alright, I need one more guy over here. What have I got? Anything? Like I said, I really kind of have to... take a look. And I mean, it's kind of stupid to wholeheartedly refuse to use, you know, like, I don't, don't want to say, like, generic units. Because there's nothing wrong with them. I mean, they're people, too. But it's just a personal bias on my part. Ooh. Not the buttons I wanted to press. Do, 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 do. I'm going to move you all over here. have here. Wait, where is this? Nope, not what I wanted to do. I really can't stress for people watching this, if you haven't actually played it, there really is a pretty significant like input lag with everything you do in this game when it comes to commands and everything. It's, it's very... It's like maybe like a third of a second, but it's, it's noticeable enough that that input lag can cause issues if you're trying to spam too quickly. I completely forgot about these guys over here. That's my bad. I should probably fix that. Not what I wanted to do again. Yes, I certainly want to ban the castle. I'm gonna like roll you over here. Yeah, that sounds good. 
I like the ones with faces. Cadis. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's move you over here. Because I do love that castle count, yo. And I am going to have to be very mindful. Very, very mindful of this. Because even though I have dragons out the wazoo, and, you know, armies aplenty, it's, it's still... And I'm, this, this, I'm being an asshole. This is me, like, totally sandbagging. It's just... I'm always cocky when I shouldn't be, and I'm always sandbagging when I have it in the bag. Don't mess with me. Or, you know, mess with me. I don't really care. Okay, you know what? Shea, Scar, Talon. That's good enough. Whoops. Again. Come on. Dragon Force 2, I will say, did get much better in terms of the, the lag and programming front. The grub stinks and they're always trying to get me killed. The better for greener pastures. Okay. What the f- what? You know what, you're just gonna like... I'm just gonna show you right here. How's that? Freaking Bastion. You're such a dongle horn. Castle. Recruit. Anybody hurt now? Aisha's back to rare and fighting form, so we should be able to take this down with little to do. Mm -hmm. Okay, Norse. I'm gonna pop Sayaka down here. If for no other reason than to just kind of do it, you know what I mean? I mean, at, at this point, it's... It's... The strategy is not nearly... Oh my god, why am I yawning? It's like 2.30 in the afternoon. What the hell is my problem? But, uh... You know, I'm, I already have two cavalry. And I think, like... I have two cavalry, two samurai, and a mage. So, I should be pretty much okay. Since they have all samurai soldiers, so... And then that's also one of the reasons I used her, is because I knew that she had at least some kind of, like, stoppy spell ability thing. Which is my preferred method. Well, I mean, not preferred method, I actually kind of hate it. But it's a nice way to make sure that, uh, I have a bit of a tactical advantage, shall we say. Disperse, because I know he has freaking spells. A doodle. Yep, there we go. Get wrecked, please. And now I'm gonna melee. Just to ensure insult injury. They're gonna line up in a nice little line that you could have killed if you'd waited about five seconds prior. Five seconds later, excuse me. I can words. Now my only issue is that he does a relatively high HP, so if I wind up doing this could be somewhat problematic. Especially given the fact that she has a very fast attack speed, so that means that she's gonna get hit with every single ability if you multi-crits. So that is something to watch out for, unfortunately. But maybe it's not, because it looks like they might wind up taking him down, so that's a plus. There we go. Of all the rotten luck, indeed. Good sir, indeed. Now, that's one down, I got three to go. By the way, Norse, you will be rotting for, like, the remainder of eternity, because I've not forgotten what you've done in three separate playthroughs so far. So, basically, get wrecked. I'm gonna drop Ardor in here. Just to ensure that Zagat will not have a, uh, will not have an opportunity to do the things that I want him to do, which is basically die. <laughs> and the AI knows it, too. It's 40 men. It's not often you see them in, a. Uh, it really is not often. Oh, Jesus. Hitting my mic. My bads. It's not often that you see the AI pick defense in pretty much any circumstance, and especially not when you have 40 troops. Thunderfall, bitches!
That was not nearly as impressive as I was hoping it would be. That is very unfortunate. He's gonna use- oh god, he has Sonic Blast, doesn't he? Oh, uh, he has Sonic Blast, that's not gonna be good. Oh, uh, please game, tell me that it's too stupid to understand to hit the spelly goodness. Flame Cannon, okay. That buys me time. Why the hell is the Goths not- did immediately use that and just wipe out three people my troops, I will not know. Maybe he's silenced or something? Maybe he's in shock of my- now he only has- okay. Okay, he didn't have Sonic Blast then. Okay, whatever. He only has Sonic Wave. Alright, um, I, I won't question it, I suppose. But that's fine. Arder has Flame Cannon. Flame Cannon is pretty nifty. Though in retrospect, it may have been better if I had just foregone using the uh, Thunderfall and just used another thing, a Flame Cannon or two, to facilitate this. Because <sighs> now he can run. And that is not what I wish for him to do. I do also have to be mindful here that I don't wind up completely depleting my uh, reserves here because I am in a level 1 castle, which does mean that I'm not going to have much in the way of reinforcements or it will take a lengthy amount of time to complete the reinforcement process, at which point they may continue to attack me unless I capture all of these motherfuckers, like, outright. So just to mix things up, mix, mix things up, I'm going to go ahead and advance just to F with their life a little bit. I'll Sonic Wave. Just to add insult to injury, murder the two that managed to survive. Oh, one still managed to survive anyway. Okay. Alright, that's pretty cool. He didn't even get a shot off. Ah, ah. Suck it. Mistal, you suck. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Let's go ahead and Sonic Boom. I'm less hesitant about using my MP versus my soldiers because MP will immediately regenerate as soon as the battle is over, provided that they're in a castle. So I can just I can just spam this shit as you know as long as the day you know as what is what is the term? You can do something as as the day is long. I think that's the terminology. That's the saying for it or something. I can spam that shit as the day is long, provided I survive the battle, and that will provide me with added use. I think I captured him. That's good. I do want to keep some cavalry reserves up. I'm gonna pop Aish in here. I'm gonna retreat to people, and then I'm just gonna have her use her little, like, floopy OP spell thing. The Holy Shield. Which is probably the most OP spell of this game. Now, to be fair, it's not nearly as OP as the healing spell in Dragon Force 2, which is legit the most OP spell. Stand by. Oh, that's gonna prove a problem. That's gonna prove a bit of a problem. Alright. He's a thief. Forgot that little bit of strategic information. But I suppose it's not gonna matter because they're getting completely destroyed. And she's actually not taking that many... Okay? Okay, she hits... He hits hard. Okay. Well, he just burned all of his MP, though, so that's good. That means he has no more means with which to attack me, which is fantastical. And I can burn time with the Holy Shield if need be. Which honestly, I may end up doing just for spite. Why am I yawning? My god, why? Brain, you were getting enough oxygen, man. You were getting more than enough oxygen. I've slept like 20 hours in the past two days, man. Like... Just, you're fine, body. Just let it go, man. One thing I did like about Dragon Force 2 also is the fact that you could change, like, the way, the, the, the angle of the camera. It's totally pointless and just there for sheer vanity. But it's pretty cool anyway. I just stopped the clock because F this guy for screwing up my plan here. One hit. They got freaking one hit. For the love of God. That's adorable. Okay. 
I was gonna say, I'm like the only person I captured was Mistal. I'm gonna be quite displeased by that. But I captured Norris too. Whoop de freaking do. Hey! Stalls, yada yada yada. Legion's control. Ooh. Okay, let's get those cavalry up and running. They're gonna be priority one, that's for certain. 100% certain at that. Let's get the Beastie Boys going. Ha ha ha. I made it funny. Army. Castle. Recruit. You know what? Am I enough of an asshole to send Tiras to attack? Yes, I think I am. Noah. Duran. Militia. Again. This is going to be a mistake. Actually, yeah, that's going to be like a huge mistake. Hang on a second. We have one, one, really? Ah, that's how you're rolling, hey? Eh? How are you doing in terms of health? You're actually quite alright, okay. So in that case, let me go ahead and just pop these guys. Don't take the captive, I don't care. I'm gonna drop you down here, force them into one spot. Enter. Uh, far for Kugan. Go ahead and get rid of these three guys. Be stealing the gold and whatnot and things. Castle. Okay, what else have we got? So they're definitely going to be reinforcing the shit out of this area, as I can tell. And they'd be correct for doing so. Exactly 60. Good. Exactly what I want to see. Okay, what else we got? So that one's going to get attacked, to be sure. I think it's Reinhardt. Who the hell is here? Oh, it's like one person. Okay, never mind. Who was more likely to run away? I do love Scar. But I do like Talon as well. I'll drop Scar, even though I've pretty much historically have had bad luck with using him in both this playthrough and last the words, the last playthroughs. I can words, I can English. Nevertheless, hopefully it'll end well this time. Maybe. Let's raid the shit out of you. Okay, what do we got? I'm going to cross flash because I'm more concerned with doing damage to the boss than to myself. Than to his army. Because his army's pretty screwed. Oh shit. Defense, please. I really need to just never use that spell. I, I never use I need to just never use that formation. It just doesn't end well. It really doesn't. Though I, I seem to be doing pretty decently. I seem to be holding my own, generally speaking. Especially given the fact that I have 15 to his 4. Stop stabbing me, thank you. Let's melee the shit out of him, 4 for 4. Harpies are very good for uh, attacking, um, attacking generals, though it seems. They have a very, very fast attack speed, so... Provided they don't have a super slow attack- the, provided the general does not have a super slow attack speed like Gongos or what have you, they will get a lot of hits in very, very quickly. Harpies are actually kind of like super OP, I guess. That's a good start. Okay. Here comes fight number like four. 
of the turn, I think. Thereabouts. Freaking uni? That's what you got? Uni? For real? <laughs> I feel bad. I'm sorry, Uni, but you're garbage. To be honest, I don't I don't think I liked any of the characters. No, that's not true. I liked Cat. And the the long-faced one, like Riger, was pretty okay too, but the other ones were kind of like just kind of garbage. I really I did not like Gongos' scenario at all. I was very displeased by its existence. I also just didn't like the character, so that probably has something to do with it. I will be playing it, just so you know. I will be playing it, and I will be playing it on camera, but I was not a fan. Now kindly murder all of his stuff. And to be fair, not to be fair, but to be honest, beasts are the only unit in Dragon Force 2 that still retained its absolutely awful reputation. She just jumped, okay. They're the only ones that retained, like, their awful status, you know? Archers were awful, they got buffed to be really good against flying units because flying units were introduced. You know, um... Soldiers were like, eh. You know, they weren't all that great. You know, like, samurai were better in pretty much every capacity because they were good at everything soldiers were good at, and they were also fantastic against dragons. This, they became great against flying units. And really good against cavalry, surprisingly enough. You know, monks in here are, were not that great. They're really good against cavalry, but they're really not great against many other things. You know, in Dragon Force 2, they're great against bandits, good against archers, I think. There's like four or five units they're actually very good against, so they're actually quite, you know, they're viable units. Beasts, on the other hand, in Dragon Force 2 are absolute garbage here. I think they are legitimately like the worst unit in the game. They're worse than bandits, which were introduced to also be awful. At least bandits are good against, I think, mages? I think bandits are really good against mages. You know, beasts aren't even good against anything. They're just like, okay, at the most. Which is kind of like garbage here. Super ultra garbage here at that. Let's give Ramsel some love. Giggity giggity. We do have that. We'll go ahead and take this group out relatively quickly. Especially given the fact that nobody has any units, so that's a thing. Nina has Resurrect, though, so wait, does she have Resurrect? She does have Resurrect. I gotta be real careful about that. I'll pit her against Ural. Oh god, sneezing time! and colds and things and whatnots. I am so sorry. This is a very professional method which which for me to do things. I, I, I'm certain I do apologize. Sincerely. But Jesus, allergies suck. Okay. I'm going to ensnare the shit out of you, by the way. It's one of the reasons that you really such a great character. I think that murders my characters too, doesn't it? Okay, hold up. She has Holy Blast. I think she's got um, Holy Shield. Yep! Haha! -ha! I'm smart! I feel SMRT, baby. There we go. And then another 10 or 15 seconds, I'll bow out again. Oh, sweet! That's right, and Snare um, freezes their power bar. That's right! I remember now! Yay! And now I've got all the time in the world. Let me go ahead and resurrect. So I can have as minimal troop loss as possible. I think I only had 70 to begin with, so this is a total waste of MP. Like an absolute waste. Uh, indeed, you have so very much to learn about strategy. It's awesome. I love it. I think Uriel's gonna be getting, like, a shitload of levels here. What do you got? Sonic Wave, Hyperstorm, okay. 
Uriel's gonna be getting a lot of levels here because she's gonna be ensnaring the shit out of all of these people. You will not be running, I can promise you that. This is another super OP spell. I saw Shakur the victory. No, no sir, you will not. I appreciate your fervor. I appreciate your uh, willingness to, you know, battle the odds, but F yourself, please. And the snare. I don't mind taking the one or two two pit loss because you will never do the things again. Now it's just a matter of watching them get destroyed, basically. Though I may just pop another Resurrect so that way, again, I can just spare myself the troop loss. And then the next two people I'll just have to eat the troop. Um, I'll just have to kind of whittle them down. So close. Let's go ahead, resurrect. That should bring me back up to 70 troops, which I can then use in the next turn. I may lose one. Oh, I lost one. Okay, that's fine. I'm at the magical number, though, so that's okay. Can't be that mad at it. Can't get salty. Okay. All right, Hickus, what do you got for me? You will be ensnared and then murdered. Same for Falalili, Lili, Lolo, 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 or whatever the hell his name is. Well, actually, he'll be he'll actually be murdered, not captured. Let's go ahead and fancy again. Melee is bad. Don't want to do it. <coughs> Excuse me. Snare. I'm so glad I leveled her past level 10. That makes my life so much better. Also, that music is is top notch in terms of uber scarinessism. So I'm not sure if I've asked this, but why are my dragons purple? I'm orange, right? Why did I not? Why do I not have orange dragons? That seems quite silly to me, and I do not understand it. You guys are so effed, you realize that, of course. But I mean, don't get me wrong, the purple dragon is cool, it just makes me think of Barney, which is not the road I want to go down with this. Come on, Hickus, be kind and die, thank you. Arg, me matey, I've been defeated. Indeed you have, sir. Most certainly, indeed you have. A little. Okay. So yeah, Uriel's gonna be like level 15 by the time this is over, I'm thinking. At least 13. This dude's gonna die. Okay. Advance. One more time, just to make sure it's... You know, that the cycle has been completed. Especially since this dude has 8 MP. That's actually kind of scary. So I want to make sure that he has the chance to only cast one thing. Scary. Spooky, scary zombie chick. Hyperstone's balls. Just so you know. It's a terrible spell and you should feel terrible for using it. This dude has a pretty decent amount of HP, though, so... I mean, there's no way he's gonna eat through, you know, 40 of these guys, because they do have relatively low attack speed. They're doing some damage, though. Oh, never mind. He's, like, getting comboed like crazy here, so... So he dies. I am very sorry for his loss, but F it. Please. Game. Thank you. Now, do I do the coup de gras and just drop her in for the last one? I think I will. Just to prove a point. I'm gonna put her in defensive formation. 
I'm gonna disperse. Actually, no, I can't put her in defensive formation because that means I don't want to be able to disperse my advanced unit. Bugger nuts. Okay. I'll leave a special formation. Stand by. Then I'll just go ahead and disperse right before the attacky stuff happens. If they pincer, they pincer. If they attack her, oh well. Disperse. Yep. Yep. Good thing I did that. Okay, now let's go ahead and melee. She might survive. Maybe. She may yet survive. Eat through those people. Eat through that group. Look at that. Look at that con carnage. That chili con carnage. I don't know how I've never made that joke before, but I feel like it should have been made now. The only issue is she's probably going to have to retreat, because I'm like 90% certain that 10 of these guys are not going to take down his entire, his entire health pool. Unless he has the worst accuracy ever. I highly doubt. Yeah, no. So I would have had to bring one other extra person for backup. They're doing some work, though. They're doing some work. I'm not gonna risk it. But they're doing some work. They got him down to half health. So yeah, there's Ural. If you haven't wanted to prove that she's completely and utterly OP, she just took down an entire, you know, complement of five generals by herself. With some benefits. I'm gonna toss him Presto. I haven't given him any love at all so far this campaign. I mean, the monks aren't great, but he has PP spelly stuff, so I may as well use it while I have it. Just the pill I need to sober up. <laughs> oh, Rudger, you rugged, drunken bastard, you. You're so lovable, even when you're a jackass. Presto Changeo, baby. Did not do nearly as much damage as I was hoping, but that's fine. Oh, he has cavalry, not monks. What the hell am I talking about? What the hell is I thinking? Is I thinking game, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I'm getting my characters all mixified up and shit. I don't know what I'm talking about. Carry on without me, my wayward son. Wait, no. I'm pretty sure I just not only butchered that comment, I'm pretty sure I also just channeled like Catherine Hepburn while doing that. So there we go. That's a thing I'm capable of doing. I mean, I already knew that was a thing I was capable of doing, but I didn't think I was capable of doing it while recording. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay, let's take stock of where I am. Am I getting attackified? No? Okay. I think I'm gonna let this turn kind of taper off. That way I can give my vocal bagpipes a rest, and that way I can come back all refreshed for the next bout. How much time do I have left? Okay. But yeah, I really... Because, I mean, aside from... Aside from... I mean, with these two castles right here being the way that they are... Oops, wrong button. You no, know, with these two castles being where they are, like... You know, this is pretty much a foregone conclusion. But anyway, thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate you hanging out, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.